The following is the story of how I got ripped off on eBay and scammed. And eBay don't give a shit. They allow their customers to rip you off. And then, still, when you leave right from negative feedback, they will remove it from their site. So that you never know who is going to scam you. I don't want to show off the code on camera in case there is. But where is my Windows Jones? Unless it's in one of the pieces of paperwork still somewhere. But it's a big piece, a big monster of a I don't care about flash intensive though, I'm just more concerned with the price and it was cheap. So that was the whole point of that. There's still a lot of loose plastic in it. Some of it's going in tight, which is a bit strange. So I may have to take it apart to get the plastic out from the side. See the sides. Like I say, no sign of the Windows activation codes. So that's concerning. Should be able to fit that PCI 3.0. This does have PCI 3.0 with the FM2 Plus AMD chip that's in it, so should all be good to go. A terabyte hard drive. That I mean, you know, I can always get more space with it and necessarily need it. DVD drive and everything again. So hey, you know, can actually do things. It lights up red, so it's like a Cylon, really. <laughs> But, you know, I mean, it'll run anything pretty much now, and there's a lot of stuff that I've been wanting to do that that should be able to run, but just doesn't, so this should be able to run and record without lag and without slowdown and without any issues. Okay, so looks like it opens up. It looks like you get the DVD drive and everything. USB port on top, the power button on top and everything. So, I don't know, for 500 quid essentially, for a full upgrade to Jassy Mexican specs. I mean, mine's DDR3, I don't know if his is DDR3. I know Golden Black or Kevin is paying like £2,000 for a slow processor. This is um, 7900 he's going to 5900 or something. So, this might be 76 I don't know, but it's a lot higher than his. And he's paying 2000 for it, and he's like, what the fuck, man? <laughs> you know, just because he's got Twitch pairs paying for it, you know, it's like... And this should be our keyboard and mouse. Black with red LEDs. There's no mouse, I'm going to be... Sorry, everything's fighting me for space on the sofa. Not very clean. Yeah, keyboard and mouse, which I didn't really mean, but, you know, I came with it. If the guy would have gave me money off of it, I'd have happily paid 20, 30 quid less to... This is a really shit keyboard. I guess when it lights up, the keys are going to be more visible. But it's also really flat. I hate flat ones. I would I'll give six of my old keyboard, to be honest. It's a shit keyboard. You know, maybe I'll sell it. It lights up, it's unused. The mouse isn't too bad looking, it's got side buttons. You know, it's an optical mouse. CIC Storm. It might not be bad. We'll see how it feels. It's got some extra things. I don't know what the DPI button does. If that's the only shit as well, then I'll just sell it as well. <laughs> Get some money back. Like I said, you know, it would have been easier to just have the discount and not have it included in the package, but I guess the seller didn't want to fat. But yeah. A lot of plastic on it for static, but other than that, I'm happy with it. So yeah, thanks for watching and we are relevant again. And hopefully my camcorder stays working in some fashion. <laughs> thanks for watching. Goodbye. Oh, uh, it's got to go back. I'm really pissed off and quite sad, to be honest. 3.1 gigahertz, how is that in any way 
4.2 gigahertz. And yeah, 10 computer cores. <laughs> Windows 10 that's valid, 64 bit. And you know, it's just the one thing that would have made the difference. Now everything's got to go back. I'm going to go try and find another good 8 gig computer with 8 gig graphics. Okay, so camcorder stopped working, so we're just going to roll with it. I've cut out the bits of the conversation to make it easier because, you know, eBay don't do stack conversations, right? So basically the seller was saying he would overclock the computer from 3.1 gigahertz to 4.2 gigahertz, send it back. And I was like, no, this after he agreed to refunds, he was trying to scum his way out of it. So I said, shame you can't put very specific processor that's 4.1 gigahertz quad core would essentially be the 4.2 gigahertz processor that, that was expected and I'd be happy to purchase them you know it's not hard to do oh yeah we can get that processor it's fully compatible you know it'd be 50 pounds more let me know and then you know if it's an FM2 plus one if not this other very specific processor a 3.9 gigahertz definitely is of course I checked on the A10 one the A10 789 OK specifically that yeah he said would be fifty pounds extra was and so you know let me know the price difference on the A8 and yes changing the process the little price difference would be ideal if not the A10 you know shorthand for the A10 789 OK 4.1 gigahertz quad core processor would be fine you know and I'd happily pay the fifty pound difference for that very specific processor. We can do you for fifty pound more the A10 7800 series, you know, scum talk, and you return the A8 7600 series, scum talk, for whatever the number that's already in there, and you know, if you agree, let us know. Yeah, that sounds fine. Expecting very specifically the A10 789. Okay, okay, arrange the whole, clip the whole unit, or would you just send the CPU? You know, should I send fifteen pounds? Blah 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 blah. You know, if you could arrange to collect the units and turn it with new CPU, let me know. Also, the keyboard's not functioning. Doesn't mention anything about that. You know, scummy scum scum wants to get away with it. That's his email address wiped out so that you can't see it because I'm protecting it. But Technocart UK don't buff them. The scummers. Okay, the payment is sent. Hopefully, my processor will arrive soon. You know, and the payment on PayPal to Tecmo Cards, that's the logo clearly, dicking on the payment for the customers. Uh, payment for the AMD A10 7890K FM2 Plus quad core 4.2 gigahertz processor as agreed upon. Delivery address, you, hopefully you can't see the fully, hopefully I've wiped it out enough, I can sort of see a bit of it. <laughs> I don't know what to look. Uh, let's just get on with it. Let's see if obviously flat, you know, who cares. Right, um, I'll check. Can you please send the A8 CPU? No, of course I'm not going to send that. Whoops, shit, I shouldn't have left your address. <laughs> Too late for that. Oh well, you know, the looks to it. The dickhead scammers, who cares. As agreed upon when the post office arrives and their safety package sent back without damaging, you know, I'll send it. Okay, we'll send you the A10 as soon as possible. It's been an early week I've sent my processor. Oh, here's the tracking number, which is fake and doesn't work. You know, I've gone to the Royal Mail website, even the next day, it still doesn't work. Uh, this is your A10-786-OK CPU. Uh, suddenly, he's going to be very specific and not scum talk about the whole thing. <laughs> as for delay, as compensation, I'm sending you much better pro No, that's inferior. It's only 3.6 gigahertz. It's even slower at the tick speeds for the megahertz it runs out. It's inferior in every single fucking way. And I've paid an extra 50 quid. Sorry, but we agreed upon the A8 A10789OK. 4.1 gigahertz quad core. Otherwise, I wanted a refund. You know, I mentioned two very specific processes. You said you'd send the A10 one, which was that one, for 50 pounds. eBay don't care that this is coming. It's only a 3.6. .6. That's just... So... Zoom, zoom, zoom out, and then paste in their feedback. My feedback got removed because, hey, 
they get to scum to scum. You know, it doesn't matter that it's negative. For the very same processor, took two weeks to send after being fobbed off, wouldn't use again. They're happy for that one because it doesn't very specifically mention how scummy they were. Arrived in time, not quite a game machine, but good, again, not as described. <laughs> but I guess they were happy to be ripped off. We had a problem! Apparently this guy sorted it out. I bet he scum sorted it the same. I bet you posted feedback prematurely. I oh, didn't receive my order. You didn't receive it. You got negative feedback and there were more negative feedbacks which had disappeared that I saw. Which were along the line of minds of how scammy they were and how scummy. And of course don't think just by avoiding eBay you avoid Technocart. They have their own website. They're on Amazon. And somehow they're getting negative feedbacks removed that are correct. I mean the majority of their feedbacks for this are negative and they've got half of them removed as well so you know scum lord of the century and I don't know why eBay are letting them get away with it. It's not right. It is not on and it's just not right at all and I've been ripped off completely. <laughs> it's a very expensive purchase and eBay are happy for the scammers to rip me off. And they're trying to go, oh, well, you know, because they, they said only A10, they didn't specifically say that. And it's like, no, you know, I said that. Oh, we can get that for you, it'll be £50. Hello, they, <laughs> they said they'd get that specific processor. Yeah, we'll do it for you for £50. It's that one, we promise. Bullshit, you sent some other shit that wasn't as agreed upon. And if I'm not happy, then I should still be able to refund, because they've ripped me off. I want a refund on the whole PC. I want a refund on that. And I'm getting fucked over in other ways, because I'm not being able to do reviews and things I wanted to do. And it's causing me depression and shit, so... Fuck the scum lords. <laughs> fuck eBay. You know, it's not on. Not on at all. You can pretty much guarantee the retard is sitting in his room going, eBay, you be a triple! As he got the fucking triple scam. Again, eBay don't give a shit. How the fuck can you trust buying anything off eBay? Feeling fucked off and pissed off today. But I've been severely depressed trying to get this shit sorted out. And I've just had it up to here. And eBay continues to, to support the fucking scum lord scammer. And I don't get it. Ah. <sighs> Apologies for no camcorder again. I would have liked to have done this on camcorder, but right now, I really want to smash some faces in. I just want my PC that I've paid for. It's fucking obvious that I've been scammed by this shit, Lords. They do nothing. Fuck eBay. Fuck techno cards. <laughs> and fuck all the fucking eBay videos of people. Ooh, but I got scams, and isn't it so good? It's to hide all the fucking real scams. 